guys. I am at Lowe's in North Bergen, New Jersey. We're here to check out Christmas decorations. As you can see, they have some wreaths out here. These are 35 bucks. This is real pine. Then there's like these uh, basket wreaths, I guess you could say. I don't think that that's a live pine in there. You can put those on your steps. And there's like these hanging bald wreaths. Let's check out what's in this store. This is one of the nicest lows in New Jersey. Very busy over here, a lot of contractors. So we have a African American Santa, white Santa. I've never seen that too much. Then we're greeted with three different trees here. I don't see a price on this one, but this is 300. And then uh, over here, that's a really cool uh, Frosty the Snowman arch. 600 bucks. I think that that's well worth it. Very pretty. Check out this Santa mailbox, guys. 129. It's so cool. These Santas are 180 each. They're about five foot ten. I love this store because they they also provide wrapping paper. They have throw pillows. Look at the size of these huge ornaments here. Seven dollars each, though. It's pretty steep. You have your camo Santa hat sequins. I would you know I would price that at like four ninety nine. But uh, it's a nice quality. This tree, by the way, was 178. So if you're looking for like, if you're moving out of the house or moving out of town in like six months and you just need that Christmas tree for a family get together and you want some decent quality, you know, this is a, one of the best stores I've been to where, the, you know, they're under $200 and you get a nice tree. I've never had a white Christmas tree like this, but um, it's kind of growing on me the more that I see. I'm going to upload a video where we were at Fortune off in Paramus and they had a, the most amazing selection of trees I've ever seen. Artificial trees. This is uh, a penguin family here for 120 The 25 inch lighted schnauzer for 80 bucks, And $200 for these three LED Christmas ornaments here. Then you have like these smaller trees, $34. Check that out. A lot of nice decorations for the front of the house here, ranging from 120, 50 to 120. There's our red truck again. Well, I'm telling you, the last seven years, five, seven years, these trucks have just been so popular. You have like these wicker bears here for $60, a Santa. I mean, that's really nice, high quality, elegant. You could even put that in the house, you know? It's like very great. I think that's a great price for 110. You have sort of a nativity scene there with little baby Jesus. 40 in, 48 inch lighted holy family, 109. And then you have like these Rockefeller angels here with a harp, that's cool. You can see they have a really wide selection of trees here. We'll take a look at those. Nice Santa sleigh there for 139. And of course they have all your timers, your extension cords. Keeps water out and lights on. Oh, that's cool. So you can put this in between your two wires. I always wondered how you keep that waterproofed. And there you go. Just give you guys an idea of the prices here. These are timers and remote on off switches. Check out all those inflatables, guys. Ladies and gentlemen. I always said to myself, but when I do a YouTube channel, I'm not gonna say guys, and I always say it. But that is a lot of inflatables. They range from $18 to About 250, 300. You have the abominable snowman up there, the Grinch. 
All right, so let's go into the forest here. Check out some of these trees. This is cool. This is like a tree with pine cones and cranberries on it. This guy goes for, uh, to be expected, 350 bucks. 378 for the very real looking um, seven foot five slim aspen fir. That's a really nice tree. It looks extraordinarily real. This is not the less more uh, paper and less plastic looking tree. The more I look at it, I think that the plastic looks more and more real to me now, but that's 180. This is 148, 129. This is 120. This is a really nice looking tree. This looks, they did a, look at how nice, great of a job that they did on, on the stem, the branch of the pine with the needles on it. I mean, that looks like a real pine tree right there. That's actually one of the realest looking pine branches I've ever seen. And this is called, the name of this company is Holiday Living, six foot five Fairmont Pine. 119 really nice tree i mean you could fill in these gaps i'm sure that they have fillers the inside shaft is is also has a uh, pine needles on it and different settings of lights they could be white they could be multicolor. It's a nice tall tree, but the top really doesn't look realistic. I don't know if it's missing a piece. That's 400. This is a GE seven foot five frosted fir. GE sells Christmas trees. And this is uh, 378. That's a nice looking tree. But you know, you have to like that snow covering on there. This is more of a forest green. This is 250. Another holiday living for 300, seven for five. This is a nice looking tree here. Let's take a look at this. Really pretty tree. It's probably my second or third favorite so far. Holiday living, $328, a seven foot five Hayden Pine. Sorry. I like how they did the, the differentiation between they have the plastic and then, I mean, if this tree was all this right here, it would be very realistic. And then they have these sort of like split end pine needles here. So three different kinds of four. And they have the paper ones too. So they have the plastic, super realistic um, split ends and the, and the, uh, the paper, I call it four different types of pine needles incorporated into one tree. I've never seen that before. $330. Check out these uh, lights on here. I don't think these are incorporated into the tree. Yeah, they are. This is a really well done, I think. It's an interesting looking tree there. I think it's not completed yet. This is the GE seven foot Colorado spruce. We'll get around to that side. These, uh, this is like a new type of light to me. I've never seen these before. They're like an orb light. Very interesting effect on that. 400 bucks. I, I have to say, guys, uh, I know I keep saying it, but from a, di I, I thought this was a real tree for a second. This is the GE seven foot five Aspen fir. 600 and i know why i mean this looks like a real tree We're on the money with that design 448 bucks for this scotch pine i actually know scotch pines and that looks very realistic for a scotch pine people might not like the long needles the biggest tree that they have here again holiday living 898 12 foot Douglas quick fold tree. I guess it folds somehow. Store your tree at a snap. 
quick fold design for quick storage. I guess you trigger that switch there and um, the tree collapses or folds very easily. That's 600. Again, that four different type of needle pine. Now that I'm looking at it a little bit more, it's kind of like a pretty serious contrast having four different kinds like that. I'm not sure if you guys would like that, but this is 500 for the snow covered pine here. Five hundred again, so it's more. It's basically GE and holiday living. But yeah, I'd have to say, in closing, I mean, besides the eight hundred, nine hundred dollar tree in back of me, they're between one hundred and five hundred dollars. My favorite tree is this one, for realism. End height, six hundred bucks. Seven foot five. The GE seven foot five aspen fir it has that full full tree look to it. It doesn't have any gaps. They could have camouflaged the stem a little bit better, but you'll cover that with your, your decorations. And here's all the trees in storage. In their boxes, I mean for tree pickup here. Don't see your tree, ask an associate for help. For all Christmas trees, scan here. And they have sort of like, uh, you have to store all your stuff at the end of the year, right? And you're always wondering, hey, what box has my Christmas decorations in it? Well, you could buy these bins that are red and green. Mm, that smells delicious. There's like this pine scent in the air here. There's some pine cones for you. There's really large bins for 60 bucks. Oh, cool. And if you have like a train set or you're into these miniatures... They have the Merry Christmas Ferris wheel. So the back wall there, the most expensive one, the houses on the mountain with the train going. Look at that, how cool is that? The train going in and out of the mountain there. Very cool setup, has some Christmas trees on it, gifts in the back. 120. Really nice piece there. That's the most expensive, and then they range down to $39. And here, they're all in your boxes here. All right, so let's check out the inflatables. So there's Santa on a train with a penguin and it's for 189, so I was wrong. 189 is the most expensive. We move down to the Grinch. He is nine feet, 129. Then your Igloo, Mickey and Abominable Snowman, large Santa, Christmas tree, dog in an airplane and another Grinch. $69 to $64, and the Santa's $45. Kudos to the store putting them in order of most expensive. Nice job to the manager. Um, snowman here, $45. Bucks. Those are really cheap, not bad for what you're getting. $18 at the end there for a Christmas tree. Then you have uh, another Santa, Mickey, Snowman. Pathway markers, you have snowflakes and then these crystal shard, uh, multi LED sparkling <laughs> pathway markers, candy canes. What do they call those mints on a stick there? Uh, the, the mints that look like that. They're just mints, right? And then you have the candy canes. And then you have like the icicle sets with icicle looking Christmas bulb. You could put this in your front porch light. More icicles. Then we get to the lights. 
you have your commercial pro 50 foot heavy duty string here but where are the bolts hmm, interesting maybe the bulbs are sold separately Ah, oh, here they are. Commercial multicolor LED C9 bulbs. 25 piece is $34. So to buy a 50 foot heavy duty set for 40, trying to read how many how many um, lights are on here fifty bulb sockets so fifty foot fifty bulbs twenty five piece is another thirty four dollars so you're at sixty nine for fifty bulbs seventy nine eighty nine ninety nine one oh nine so $109 per 50 feet for Commercial Pro with the multicolor bulbs. Or you could do red or you could do white or green. So 109 for 50 foot. Typical house is what, guys? Like maybe 200 foot of lights if you want to get crazy. So there you go. 450 bucks. And they'll, they'll last you for like 10 years. Hopefully. Here's some more lights here. 25 count. Uh, let's see. I'm looking for the smaller lights. Here's the 100 LED, 100 count LEDs for five bucks. That's a really good price. It's one of the lowest I've seen. Then you have the larger bulbs, 25 count for $12. These are cool. Uh, some more candy canes here. These reefs are pretty expensive. Reefs, uh, forty-five dollars, sixty bucks for this, but it has a truck. And this this is this is also lit up, so it runs off batteries. In the back, and you have your red truck that you could bend into place properly. That's a hell of a wreath there. This is more of a classic. $70 though, I mean, 40 bucks maybe. But it's nice. Here's your electric fireplaces. $700, this is a more modern one for 200. Assorted metal garden decor, $32.98. Santa, snowman. Unfinished wood crafts. Interesting. So these are cut into different shapes. They're like uh, snowflakes, angels. You could paint them with the kids. These are wooden discs. I know a YouTuber that filled this whole wall with these. Wrangler Star. That guy knows everything about everything. And these fireplaces continue 300, 399. Which one's your favorite? For my house, I'd have to get this one. Not bad for 200. You know, set it up in the in Christmas, right underneath the TV with the tree, just to get that feel, and you're good to go. The throw pillows. Somebody was asking me how much were they? They're 20 bucks. Now I put these in front of a restaurant. These are really good quality, actually. Uh, I wrapped them around the tree. They're uh, 60 count LED lights. Very thin, low profile. If you really want to decorate, uh, they could run on tri uh, three AA batteries just for the holidays. You don't have to worry about the sun. You could put it, I don't know if you could put them on the timer. You'd have to walk out and turn it on, but $8, you could light up the tree in front of your house. Unless you have a really big uh, tree in front, then probably best to hire somebody. Check out this uh, big joy up here. And this is more Winnie the Pooh and Mickey Mouse. There's Mickey and Minnie kissing back there. 
more pathway lights. If you're a Mickey and Minnie fan, this is the store to go to. Holiday pathway lighting, 25% clearance. You have a ho 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 up here. Hundred and twenty nine, one twenty five, fifty bucks. There already looks like there is a nutcracker, Santa. Oh wow, North Pole. There's Santa in his red truck again. Here's more of the smaller inflatables in this aisle. Wreaths. Tree fillers. When you buy a tree and you lost your fillers, you can buy these. Poinsettias, two dollars. It's not bad. These are eight, twenty bucks. So let's go up here. I should do a power tool uh, episode. I should have done a, a leaf blower episode. Was, uh, I think I missed the mark on that one. It's pretty expensive for a snow brush, but they look like they're really high quality, 18 bucks. I mean, this could reach across the top of a whole truck. Oh, here we go. How about some snow blowers? So they range from $4.99 all the way up to probably $2,500. Let's see. No, not bad. $1,900. I never really heard of this company, but uh, I have yet to buy one of these. Probably this year. I'd probably go for more something like this range, $1,150. But I mean, the, the best time to buy these is clearance in the summer. Or uh, there's a chainsaw repair guy in my town that actually rents some out that people never picked up, moved away, who knows what happened. This is a really nice grill. I bought this. Never had any problems with it. I like to have it where the propane is underneath enclosed and it has a side burner. 350. I looked around everywhere. Nice heavy lid, warms up really quick. This is uh, something I want to get into. I heard this is a really great product, pizza ovens. Just set that up and make the kids a pizza. And they sell all your extra spices here, and I don't. I know that they have uh, apple wood and other other woods here. I just haven't seen them. This just comes right out. This is like a ceramic base in there. Kind of an interesting enclosure there. Cooks in 60 seconds. Heats to 950 degrees. Multi fuel. Stone baked. I have to research that a little bit more. Multi fuel. Oh, here's some more fireplaces here. Uh, actually, I'd probably buy this one. So this is three ninety nine, four ninety nine, four ninety nine. Nice big mantle on the top of this one. This has a stone face around it. Really cool. Three ninety nine. All right, guys. That's it for Lowe's in North Bergen. 
See you later.